Hello everyone! In today's video, I will be sharing some footage of BTS from my album release party. I choreographed a dance with a friend, so I'll be sharing some footage of our rehearsals and coming up with the dance, and then also the performance rehearsal as well. And then we have a little Q&A after talking about Mercy's movie and people's feedback on the performance. So I hope you guys enjoy. It's been a year since the release party, so it's been really fun to look back at all the footage and I'm really excited to share that with you. If you haven't already, subscribe to my channel for more content, leave me a like and comment, and yeah, let's get into it. This is my friend Yoselin. She helped me choreograph this dance. At first, we just free flowed and moved to however the song felt like to us. We started to keep some of the moves that we liked and laid it out based on the lyrics. I say, is it you? Is it me? Is it a wondrous possibility? Mm -hmm. So maybe on is it you? Is it me? That's when like we can face each other. Wondrous possibility, and then I say, Will I ever see you? And then I go into singing, and then when we spin, um, do you want to keep it like this? Yeah, okay. yeah, okay, okay cool. <laughs> we even came up with this cool butterfly looking dance move, I loved it. Dance takes a lot of energy. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's see what that looks like. All right, perfect. Where is it? That unconditional love. 
Second night, I met up with my girl Kayla, and she was so kind enough to help me out with this as well. This was her first time using silk fans, so it was really fun getting to teach her. And it reminded me of when I also first started, so I totally understood the different ways that the silk fan could be a bit challenging. For it being her first time, she got it down really quick, and she did absolutely amazing. Right there. Yeah. Okay. So that's when we start walking towards each other. Um, that part is gonna be the one where like when we're on the ground like that. Oh, oh, gosh. Gotcha. Like go up. On okay. That note. Okay. Okay. That's it. Okay. So I think um from the beginning it's like 16 counts until um that sound comes in. So after we're like going like this towards the audience a little yeah. bit, it goes like unconditional love, and then when that part and then goes, you spin out. yeah, we spin. And then um, we'll go towards the audience again, just dancing towards them. I'd say just like rotating your arms like left and right. Yeah, that's cool. And so let's try to do that part. So I'm gonna start speaking in Spanish and that's gonna be your cue to get up and then start like dancing around Jocelyn and she'll like take the same spot as you just like on the floor doing the waves. Okay. So you'll have quite a bit to just dance around her. And we, it, like the imagery was like, you're like healing her with your fans while she's sitting there. So just like be like dancing around her and like at her. Okay. And then, um, yeah, let's run that and see. I think yes. that's where I'm gonna Okay, that feels a lot more... Yeah, like more secure? Yes. Okay, cool. It is tricky, like in the beginning I was struggling with that too, but I think like with time of using it, you'll find like the right spot in your own hand. Okay. And I feel like, yeah, just make sure like your thumbs are controlling it. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Let's I think she's ready. Yes! Yeah. <laughs> Run sideways like that. Okay, I did that wrong, huh? Okay. We'll do so like this. Yeah, and then we'll just run go run after me like Okay. There we go. Okay. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, I'm gonna look at the video and see how we did it. Okay. Cause okay. I totally forgot Loki. Can I borrow these? Oh yeah. Okay, I was sure. like, yeah. I was like, it'd be home. really, really helpful. Yeah, dude. Okay, Take cool. them home. Um, practice. Going to the park is so fun. Just like frolic. Oh <laughs> yeah. I like already know which park I'm gonna go to and everything. Yeah. <laughs> what is it? And then I'll tell you your uh, cue to get up and freestyle around me.
you want to run it back from the beginning or how do you yeah, feel? Yeah, let's do it from the beginning. Okay. Did, yeah, together. That's crazy. <laughs> Is it uh, facing you on the camera? Yeah. Okay, cool. Thank you. Lights turn off. You come on stage. I play this song. Build up to the suspense, you know? And then I think when it goes, Duh, I'll turn the lights on, okay? So lights go off. Oh my okay. god! As above, so below. This is the light oh, wave. Oh shit. Okay. So it's just gonna be black. Oh, I get nervous about using this because it's already lost so much of the fibers. So I'm trying not to use it as much as I can so I can maintain the fibers. Even when you ask, don't think. Even when you ask, don't think. Party lights, power.
ready? Yeah, what'd you say? If you had a thousand dollars, what would we buy in Jess? Oh, dang. Okay, well, we gonna need some new speakers because once we got it, just ain't cutting it. So. These Adam ones go crazy. For real? Remember that guy when he was mixing our music, he had these? Really? Which guy? You know that guy. From Mobile. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. He had, he had these Adam speakers. <laughs> Did you guys think about Jess's music? We oh, yeah. yeah. love it! We love Jess! We love Jess! I want it. I want to ask you guys what we If I like Phil, I'll take it from you, girl. Or at least try. Good man. I think you guys complement each other because you guys help each other. Yes. What were some of you guys' favorite songs uh, that you guys enjoyed? I like the last one. Pout. Yeah, oh, what's yeah, that? Yeah. 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 <laughs> blessings on Blessings? Uh, Into the Light, I believe. Light. Yeah. Yes, you liked all of them, Carlos? I love the one. I love when, you yeah. Yeah. Honestly, when you guys work together, it's amazing. Honestly, when you guys work together, it's amazing. Thank you. I want to see the writing. Oh, oh, yeah, I want exactly what you Let's put on Genius! Yes! Genius lyrics! Yes! Anyone else know other song that they like? Ooh, I really like uh, the one where <laughs> she was talking about how like she feels God there, like God is there. Yeah, What's that one? I think it's Jude. Is it Jude? It's the one about Papa? Where's Papa? <laughs> <laughs> and the one where it's like, it's hard to call you my father. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay, that's lukewarm. I see. Yeah, 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 that one is really good. And then the Light Whip song, I was just like, I'm with <laughs> 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 The Light Whip one. <laughs> yeah. I agree. Honestly, let's just be real. Like, it's nice when people love each other. Yeah. And that's what you guys do. Yes. Yeah. 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 <laughs> yeah. yeah. All the new songs you write. Mm hmm. Yeah. Do you want to share a little more like that? Oh, it's really, uh, really it's okay. Oh, okay. <laughs> He's just like, I'm trying to kill time, yeah, Jez. <laughs> oh, I just put it out so it should be out in five days. Oh, just about yeah. Congrats! Thank you. Thank you. Don't be shy to su subscribe to her channel. <laughs> <laughs> if you haven't yet, subscribe to my YouTube. Melka's a feeling. Everybody can go follow her right after. <laughs> Mercy, yes. At Milk is a feeling at Jenna. Mercy low key, who's really in charge? Milk is a Jess. Good answer. Good answer. Guys, take notes. What should I say just to that? God. Am I allowed to stop this? God's in charge. God's in charge. I love Jess. God's in charge. That is so awesome. <laughs> Uh, before I share about my movie, I just want to tell a special story about Jess. Um, I was working at a place called the Church of Truth. I met some of you guys there. Um, some of you guys don't know that it was really hard running a place like that. Um, when I was working there, actually, everyone basically turned on me. It was, it's hard to be a manager somewhere when everyone like, basically hates you. But Jess became my best friend, and, um, and it was a really strange situation to be in because the guy who owned the place let me manage it, but it was just a conflict of interest because he had his nephew come in and he messed everything up for me. But Jess was there for me at a time where no one was there for me. And um, and we were able together to do a lot of cool stuff at the church despite having everyone there hate me. Um, and so when Jess, when I met Jess and she would sing, there's a story in the Bible about a man named King, uh, King David who was being 
No one really liked him either. And he was serving under a person that hated him. And this guy was, his name is King Saul. And so that guy was tormented by his own demons. Um, and so he would have King David come in and sing for him to be relieved of all the bad demons and all the bad things he was going through. And that's what Jess was for me. Whenever she would sing, I would feel like a sense of healing. Um, and so I asked her one time, because I was like, dude, you should record your music. And she was like, and it's so like unfathomable to me. Because she said to me, she was like, no, I kind of just like doing it for fun. And yeah, that's not true. <laughs> and she was not in that point um, three or four years ago. She wasn't even thinking about recording her music. And so later on at the church, they gave me some money to produce a, an audiovisual album and I asked Jess to participate, where she uh, first started recording her music. And I remember she laid down this like hook, and there was like 10 people in the studio, and everyone was going crazy. <laughs> Um, Kevin was also part of it. It's my friend Kevin. Yes, he's an amazing artist. My friend Ozzy here. I got to meet her that time. Um, and it was just like a beautiful uh, experience because it was like at that moment, it was like, it, it, has anyone ever seen B.I.G. where he like first raps and everyone was like, oh my God, you gotta like lay it down. Like that's exactly like that. <laughs> everyone was like, oh my God, yes, you know? And I had this so you're the big mama. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what tiny bod? <laughs> and um, and it was so cool because I know at that time Jess um, couldn't see it, but like I remember I heard her first seeing at an open mic, and I always knew like this is different. Like there is something different about your voice and the healing that I get to experience. I like the world to hear it. <laughs> and many years later, Jess has finally been able to finish her album, and it's so cool. Um, the reason why we abruptly did this event, because me and Jess have been, had a lot of unfortunate situations, like my computer crashed, and they didn't know if I was able to retrieve my film that I spent a lot of money on and time on. Then Jess's hard drive broke down, and she didn't know she could get her music back, but thank gosh she had some of the songs, and I had some of the songs, and then we just felt like, you know, it's never going to be a perfect time, although we would, you know, like it to be more grand and in a movie theater or like in an auditorium, but it just feels nice, you know, whoever's meant to be here, I'm glad you're here, you know, and I hope you guys are also touched. Thank you. We love you. We love you. We love you. We love you. Woo! Um, you know the part of the club scene, um, and they were doing, like, they were talking about how hot yeah. they the girl was and yeah. it was like I thought that she had a boyfriend I, I wasn't sure who was like saying what yeah. so oh, it was yeah, like my bad. it's probably my fault but it was um, oh, yeah, no. the, the dialogue was under the person that was speaking oh yeah, yeah, yeah. no mm -hmm. but I just mean like cause I thought that he was her boyfriend for yeah her. that's what I thought too. yeah I that's like, what is I he referring to, to, to himself? himself and then he's like also the guy that's like hitting on her at the party and like yeah. she's giving mm -hmm. out her Instagram to everyone yeah, I don't know. I kind of yeah, yeah, see, my yeah, thing yeah. is, I thought, I thought that that scene was the way he viewed it going on, like the way that she's acting when he's not around. Oh, like she's kind of yeah, yeah. supposedly like out there, just like, oh, you know, you, I got a boyfriend, but I'm just talking, I'm just flirting, I'm not doing anything. So, yeah, like, there you go, Ozzy. I mean, like, please, I've seen yeah. the Odyssey. So if you've seen the Odyssey and you've rewatched it, every single one of those short films transitions perfectly over to the next one. Mm. And if you miss it, you yeah. gotta rewatch it. And right. <laughs> I guess that's the beauty about the film is it hosts oh. that conversation. Oh. Like, right. Should I should I like have you guys <laughs> I just, what's the line and like what is healthy and what is not yeah. healthy and like how yeah. do you meet, you know, your partner in the middle and mm. like I think yeah. communication is I mean, like, no, it's so different with everyone too. That's true. It's so different. On purpose in the beginning, like, how do you think the other person has checked their significant? You no, know, that's other ironic. Person. I didn't. I know. I thought that was a random card. The first question was too easy. This was all intentional. Oh my god! Oh my god!
So, like, I think it's cool that this is a conversation that's very healthy and intentional for people to talk about. Mm -hmm. It's just, like, intentional, I suppose, as opposed to just being, like, vulgar or, like, very, like, triggering, you know, like, mm -hmm. all that kind of information, yeah. Yeah, I feel like it was really relatable. Just like... <laughs> 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 no, I feel like we figured that out. Have any of you guys been in an experience like that before? Mm -hmm. Just like social media. <laughs> uh, <laughs> yeah, you have? I feel that. Yeah, I have too. <laughs> what was that, Carlos? Yeah, yeah. It's like mad. Well, now you know. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> next generation problems. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Um, okay. <laughs> the next one's about streaming on Twitch. <laughs> <laughs> it's like... Yeah, it's like reconnected. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> reconnected. I'm curious about Ryan. How cool is it to see your daughter acting? What? <laughs> what? She said what? You know, I'm, I'm really proud and I'm really, really happy that she, she gets to experience this with you guys. And Aww. you guys definitely do bring out a lot in her. Bring it back to like, <laughs> <That's very laughs> like, like, her. Who she guys. is when she was young. And, uh, and you guys are bringing that out a lot. So. Every everything you guys do here is beautiful to me. Oh, oh thank you, oh, Ryan. Oh, nice. You the best. Yes. <laughs> yes. What about Andres's mom? How do you? Is this the first film you saw your son in, or you yeah, seen him in other yes, stuff? Yes, first time. <laughs> How did you like it? Seeing your son in film.
pure love, I think. Yeah. And I understand that. Like, it feels, when you feel that pure love, it feels very different, I think, from what you see here. Mm -hmm. Because there's, like, this, like, shady stuff going on. Yeah. And he's, like, insecure. Mm -hmm. And he's, like, yeah. what the hell, dude? It's really <laughs> the color, like, how you use the colors to, like, portray his anxiety mm -hmm. and his fear, but also his, like, feelings for her, like, so conflicted. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. I think it's a really great like conversation starter for a lot of people too. Like, yeah. I think it's really great that it exposes a lot of people to things that they may not be super comfortable talking about at first. Mm -hmm. But once they see it, they're more like, okay, like, okay, so what do you think about this? Yeah. You know what I mean? So I think it's a great like way to introduce a lot of new like ideas to people. Yeah. Which I think True. is beautiful. Like you do, a, you do a really great job at it. You know, yes. like they're not comfortable yes. ideas, Same. but like they're very important. And like Woo. I think everyone should really be having them, especially like at this time of like you know our generation, our time. Mm. So. Bye. I love it. I love it. Mercy. You're doing great. Yeah. Yeah. I appreciate it. Yeah, Black, Dude, Mirror Black Mirror vibes for, for sure. Yeah. Well, I was saying, like, yeah, you're right, because it's, like, very thought-provoking. Yeah. So it's just, mm -hmm. like, that social media episode yeah. with the ratings and stuff. Yeah. 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 Yeah, I'm really glad that um, you guys were patient. Um, I know it's probably not at the level of, like Netflix, but it was Please, a lot of Netflix. love. <laughs> I'm gonna rewatch it when I go home. I'm sorry. Oh, <laughs> dude, you're um, awesome. Again, thank you guys for sitting and watching and uh, listening to Jess's album. Um, Yay! Yeah. <laughs> like that's that nice. Amazing. Thank you. We're gonna um, just hang out, drink some wine. Bonfire. You guys are more than welcome to stay. There's no, That's uh, my guess, favorite. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> um, but if you have to leave, it's always love. You know, don't worry. <laughs> Thank you.